took Alpha. Oh. I'm sick of these fucking snipers in this game, dog. Damn it, this shit. Jesus Christ, look at this shit. Look, look at this. Nigga. This shit is glitching. Word, son. What do you do, YouTube? We should watch that line. All right, man. Before we get into this video, make sure you hit the like button, comment, subscribe. And there's a good percentage of y'all still not subscribed when y'all watch these videos. So do me a favor. Let's get that percentage down. I think it's still like in the 80s still, maybe 83%, whatever the number is. Make sure y'all get that down for me. Hit that subscribe button. Click that bell icon so you're notified every time I upload. Without further ado, let's get up into it. So, in that sniper clip, I showed y'all in the beginning um, with the commentary in the beginning also. Um... This is my life on Cold War, and I hate it. I know I said in the last video that I wasn't gonna touch uh, Cold War until they fixed that issue. So there's three issues that are like blaring to me at least: the visibility, which is terrible, the the uh, the weapon flinch, and then the weapon balances. This whole scenario about no weapon flinch, this is going to be the deal breaker, because in every year of Call of Duty, in the that like this is always what made Call of Duty Call of Duty. You know, making making it a cohesive first person shooter. There's always been weapon flinch. Okay, that, that's just what it is. If you're aiming at somebody, you're aiming at something and you're getting shot, the weapon flinch is gonna throw your aim off. That's just what it is. That's how it's always been. But Mr. Flame here, Tony Flame, he says that we're going to make weapon flinch minimal to none, and I'm paraphrasing, for this year of Call of Duty. Don't know why he thought that was such a great idea. Mr. Flame, I want you to understand something. I don't know what people in the cock community have told you, whether it's the pros, the casuals, or people who just who who want an advantage, who use snipers, but whoever told you that literally played you for a fool and you went right into their hands with this one. This is my life on Call of Duty. Every time I'm in a match and I'm matched up against a sniper, doesn't matter if I put shots on him at first, it doesn't matter what I do. If I put shots on him and he's looking right directly at me, he immediately gets the kill. Why? Because my shots, matter of fact, it's not even my shots, the weapon flinch isn't, isn't, it isn't prominent enough for him to knock his aim off so he doesn't get the shot off. If he gets a flinch hat shot on me, so be it. It is what it is. But I refuse to sit here and believe that every time I get matched up against a sniper, that he still has a valid chance of killing me. I don't care that he has a bead on me when he sees me. If I put the shot on him at first to throw his aim off, I should be just fine. But no, this no weapon flinch is letting these guys still stay alive. They're letting them breathe. And Flame, when I tell you that this is pretty much the life of every Call of Duty right Call of Duty player right now, this is it. All the people who are gonna jump in this comment section and please don't come out here in this comment section talking about, oh, you're just mad, you can't aim, you can't snipe. Well, why don't you just start sniping and just nullify that? I mean, get good. You're lazy. You just can't do this. Stop being toxic. Because that, that first of all, that's your problem. That's a problem in the cock community now. They're so unreasonable at times when stuff like this happens that they that they feel like Call of Duty can't do wrong. The same way I feel about people who talk about man in the positive light, even when it's bad. People feel like Call of Duty can't do nothing wrong. They feel like these developers are just are just gods. They feel like they can't do nothing wrong. But the minute that something like this, which is a legit complaint, pops up, the first thing to do is blame the user. Get out of my comment section. All right. Now, back to the whole weapon flinch thing. Weapon flinch needs to come back because I'm not going to sit here and keep dealing with snipers running around here acting like they're trying to be they're, they're trying to get a highlight video for for phase. And I'm over here just trying to level up my AR, my other weapons and all this other stuff. Where I'm just trying to have a good time. And the first thing I get is a tryhard who just runs around the corner, slide around the corner, jump around the corner. And regardless if I got my beat on him and I land the shots first, I'm still dying because why? There's a weapon flinch. I should not have to put on the most OP weapon to com to compete and make sure that I don't die. I, I feel like I should use any weapon I feel like I want to use just because of how I'm feeling that day or because it's my favorite weapon, not because it's the, it's the weapon to use if you're trying to compete. This is not why I play Call of Duty 4. 
I play Call of Duty to have fun, not get on here and play against tryhards, especially with the change of weapon flinch. This ain't it, Tony Flame. This is not it. So please, if you see this video, if anybody's watching this video, please forward this to him. Please forward it to him. I already made a tweet respectfully asking him to put the put flinch back. But this video should be evidence as to why I say that. I'm not saying nerf snipers and make the snipers to where they're just hit, hit marker machines, but you need to make it to where if you're going to put the flinch back and make it to where that if snipers, just not even snipers in general, just, just weapon flinch all together. If I'm aiming at you and I shoot you first, do not keep his target on to me because it's never been like that. Don't change it for the casuals. Don't do that. So like I said, if anybody's, see, if anybody's watching this video, forward this to Tony Flame. Please forward this to him. Because I, for one, am pissed off. And I'm sick and tired of Call of Duty changing stuff around. First it was Von the Heart, now it's Flame. I'm sick of this. Put Weapon Flinch back. I can deal with low visibility. I can deal with probably weapon balancing. But if you don't fix the flinch, this is going to be a long year for Call of Duty. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. And like I said, don't get on here being toxic. Please don't. Because I don't have time for, 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 the, for the stupidity that a lot of guys will love to do when it comes to Call of Duty. Don't have time for it. So like I said, make sure you hit the like button, comment, subscribe, share the word, spread links, man. Y'all know how I do. I'm going to get up out of here. She was Jay Devon and I'm signing out. Peace.